Okay, this is part two of how to fix your internet problems and the controller is not connecting thing. Once you've taken out all of these various screws, make sure you have all of them out because I just spent like 10 minutes pulling and pulling at this realizing that I forgot this screw right here and for some reason it was keeping the entire thing down. So uh, this whole top part right here, this whole top should pull off, set that aside. And make sure to keep all your screws organized. These ones are the ones that are going to be coming out. So, and now I spent. Hold on, turn this around for you. And uh, if you have been running your PlayStation lately, this will be hot. So while well, it's like really warm right now, and I, my PlayStation's been off for a half hour at least. So anyway, just a little, a little information. This is the power supply. Plugs right into the back. This is the uh, the discs the disc uh, reader slash blu-ray player and this which is what I was confused about this if you see right here has a little black cord oh, let me get it more in the light it has a little black cord that runs in between these and comes out and plugs into this now for a while I was confused as to what that was and then I realized it's an antenna so then that got me thinking that that must be the problem and I looked up online and what I found out is, hold on. <laughs> I need to get it in a good spot so you can see it in the light. And uh, the problem is with this thing right here. This is the main problem. What you're going to want to do is unscrew these two screws right here and pick this up. Be careful because this thing's still connected. And then make sure that this, hold on. this thing right here make sure that both sides of that are connected if and make sure that they're connected good like actually connected because if not both if both sides of those are not connected then this thing right here will not be receiving power from the motherboard down bottom and therefore your antenna will not be receiving any power at all and so yeah, so you want to make sure that both sides of those are connected for the internet problems and for the controller. If you if if once you make sure both of those are connected, if your controllers still don't work, then uh lightly press down on this and turn it a little bit. And that'll ensure that the power is going into this wire and over to the antenna for your controllers. And that's all that I did to fix my PlayStation. I hope it works out for all of you guys if you were having some problems with it too. And uh, if anyone else is having any problems with their PlayStation, like any problem at all, uh, send me either like a description of what's going on or a video of what's going on, and then I will do my best to try to figure out what is wrong and try to fix it. So yeah, <laughs> that's pretty much all I have to say. Alright, keep watching.